amazing, amazing facility that has inspired so much creativity and will inspire generations of creativity. My name is Ryan Edwards, and I'm a principal and co-founder of Masari Studios. I use the He series, and I'm here celebrating, announcing, and sharing our new artwork, Memory Diffusion. This project is a new monumental media sculpture um, in the Boston Arts Academy. Um, and we responded to um, a request for qualifications um, issued by the city to create a new artwork here at the school. One of the things that I like to think about is what are we doing to co-create the city we want to live in? You know, not just being happy or being frustrated that, that it's not what we want, but how can we invest and make it cooler, make it more the place that we're excited to live? So this is an opportunity that kind of invited us, like, you know, in the Performing Arts High School, in your home city, what should it look like? There are two cameras uh, at the heart of the piece, and these cameras watch the space in front of it in, in the main entryway here at the school. And the piece uses a number of machine learning algorithms to determine whether what's happening in front of the artwork is something similar to what has happened in front of the artwork in the past, or whether it's very new and unique. And if it's something that is, the, the term that I've been using is sufficiently novel, it'll record that and store it in a database. And at the same time, it's constantly remembering previous memories, memories uh, that it has previously stored. Public art so often is done up to a certain point, but uh, in a way it feels never quite finished because of how the public is always changing certain perceptions of it, how they're experiencing it differently. Um, and so there are some unknowns that stay consistent from whether or not it's going to exactly be like the renders or the visions that we see it early on or how people are actually going to interact with the work once it's installed. I love having those slivers of curiosity still within a project that feels so resolved yet at the same time. So far the response for the artwork uh, has been overwhelmingly positive. I think uh, with students finally seeing the work in context to the whole new facilities they have, it's been uh, quite exciting and um, invigorating for their start to their school year. I think having something like this to inspire the students in their own creative works is something that we should all be looking forward to as so many people share the same values that have gone into the production of a building like this, supporting students, minority students, and creative endeavors. So having the response from such a new, fresh group of students in this generation to new tech digital art within their own school has been so exciting. So hopefully over the time that students first walk into the school and from the time they graduate, they begin to know this artwork as something unique and something that remembers them as well. So eventually over time they can have more nuanced interactions in their everyday experiences and yet still become inspired from their first day or their last day here at this school.